Yeah, that, that was a cool brother, man. Yeah. yeah. All right, hey, Shalom, Shalom. We want to start off by giving all praise and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, and peace and blessing to the brothers and sisters scattered across the four corners of the earth, learning and or teaching this word in truth and sincerity. And we want to, how you doing that, sister? How you doing? Hey, what we want to do amongst the, the madness and confusion that's going on amongst our people is we want to make sure that we get the steps and, and preach this gospel out because the end is coming soon, as we've been saying a lot of times you hear a lot of brothers say that and why we notice you see this stuff man it's protesting we don't want our people being in the line of fire through this man it, it's all it's going to do is set y'all up to get killed man because that's what they're planning on they had this planned out you know uh, it, that's, that's just like um in, 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 in minnesota they had a uh, one that set the fire at, at auto zone it was a cop it, was, it wasn't a, a jake or, or uh, Israelite, it was a cop yeah. that was setting those places on fire. So it's not us per se doing all of it. Yeah. The, initi the, the initiation when they did the auto zone was a cop. cop. Same same people that that, that that took George Floyd off his planet. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's it's all a setup, all from the elites. You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. So we want to tell our people there's gonna be vent there's gonna be justice, um, and because that's what our people are searching for. They're searching for the justice. And the vengeance that are done, that's done and happened to our people, such as George Floyd, uh, Breonna Taylor, all these unrighteous acts. Huh. You know, we could go all down the list, man. If we, we, if we counted down all the people that this has happened to, we would, this the whole lesson would just be us listing names, man. Right. But the only, the only, we got to let other people know the way that we're going about it isn't the right way, man. You're, you're setting yourself in the line of fire to be killed. You know what I'm saying? That's just all that's happening. So... In order to get this vengeance, in order to seek this justice that's going to happen, we got to come back into the power of our Heavenly Father, Yahweh, and follow His only begotten Son, our Lord and Savior, Yahweh Shai, man. Uh -huh. And the steps to, so we, we, we talked about this, man. We talked about um, what it takes to believe in Yahweh Shai. You know, the things that, key elements, man, of this gospel uh -huh. that must be preached, right? Uh -huh. We talk about the name, the name you got to believe in the names, Yahweh and Yahweh Shai. You gotta believe uh, who he came to save his people. Who uh, the people are he came to save? The Israelites. The, the Israelites, the people who need saving on this earth. How you doing, that sister? Yeah. Hey, brother, y'all, y'all come and hear us off for a little bit, man. Hear the I word, man. Are you sure? All right. Yeah. So this, we, we try to get this out to our people to hear the word according to truth and sincerity. Because see, that's just now. Just nobody wants, nobody wants to that's it. the thing. Even for five minutes, we get we can get this gospel to you in five minutes. Know what you got to do, and then at least you heard it. You know what I'm saying? But if you don't hear it, if you don't go towards the word, that destruction coming, man. It's coming. Your heart was not going to take you in at that last point of time if you don't if you do not do the, the steps according and follow his commandments, man. So you got to believe in him, of course. Believe in uh, keeping the commandments of Yahweh Shai, which was ordained from Yahweh. And believe that Yahweh Shai rose on the third day. Once you believe in, you believe in these key elements of the gospel, now you are able to get baptized in water in the name of your house child for the mission. That had to be done, man. Not, not just the word. That, 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 no, not it's not just, even, not even, not not even the, the word. word. Not even the word is is your know, sanctification, right? God. You know what I mean? We got stages. Exactly. A B C D. Exactly. You know what I'm A lot of our brothers unfortunately believe, ancestors believe that, you know what I'm saying, it's, it's just hearing the word and I say you've been baptized by hearing the word. But according to the scriptures, we're gonna we're gonna tell you that this baptism is done in water, and this is a commandment. Water baptism is a commandment. There's certain key people in the in the scriptures that did it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. I mean, key people. Yeah. And we're gonna go when we we're, go through the scriptures. We, we go over that today. We're gonna, but there's key people. Yeah, we're gonna get into the lesson of of it's the counsel of Yahweh, man. So you reject the water baptism in the name of Yahweh Shah for remission of your sins. You rejecting Yahweh himself, man. There's no other way around it. You rejecting Yahweh's counsel, man. Um, that's why this lesson right here, the scriptures that brothers we realize that brothers of our of, of Israel do avoid, man. The certain ones, like um, this one is is the biggest avoided one. We don't get into. Uh, let's get into Hebrews six and one through two, huh? Yep. 
I'm gonna pack up my mouth at 21, 25. It's all good. It's all good, man. We want y'all to understand this, man. This is for this is for your salvation. For brothers and sisters who don't know, who are learning Yahweh Shai, and for brothers who they know Yahweh Shai, but if you don't do this baptism correctly, you don't know him. This is in the name of Yahweh Shai for remission of sins, man. You must go down in that water uh, to, to enter into this kingdom, man. Hebrews 6 and 1. Uh huh. Swat you. No, no, you got it. Go ahead. Swat you. <clears throat> this is Hebrews 6 and 1. Uh -huh. Therefore, leaving the principles of the doctrines of the Yahweh Shai, let us go on unto perfection, not laying again the foundations of repentance from dead works uh -huh. and, of all, and of faith towards Yahweh. Uh huh. Let's move forward to that. That's what it's saying. Let's okay. say, let's go, let's, let's make the move. Let's go forward towards the faith towards Yahweh. Let's not lay these foundations again. What are these foundations? Foundations of repentance. Uh -huh. From dead works. Uh -huh. well, and we, of faith towards Yahweh. And what we read to? Of the doctrine of, the, of baptism. Uh -huh. Of laying on of hands. Uh -huh. And of the resurrection of the dead. Uh -huh. And of eternal judgment. Okay, so we got those four elements, right? Uh, those four elements that it's saying, let's, because every time, when I first heard this scripture, when I, you know what I'm saying? I'm still, we still learning. We still brothers learning and picking up, going into everything. But, because you, you always got to be learning, right? Even even brothers saying they're master teachers, man, you got to be learning, bro. You got to come into a babe. But anyway, when I, was, when I heard that scripture, it was brought to me when I was in a debate with a brother, and it was brought to me saying, Oh, see, let's not talk. Let's not do this again. Let's not go to this. That's what it's saying. And it, he's right. It's saying, let's not lay these foundations again. Let's not go to it. But here's the here's the here's the problem, right? How can you um, not go to it again if you've never been there in the first place? Oh. You know what I'm saying? If I said, brother, if I said, brother, we we let's say we, we on the football team, right? And say, hey, oh man, let's let's yo, so let's go to the uh, let's start the football season. Let's go straight to the playoffs. We in week four of the regular season. <laughs> playoffs. <laughs> Playoffs? You said I got 12 more games. Come on, man. You know what I'm saying? Come on, man. Playoffs? You, you talking about playoffs? We ain't get four, there yet, man. Four, four. Come on, man. We, we ain't get four there. Yeah. Come on, <laughs> you, man. You got it. We got 12 more games, baby. Come on, man. It's, when, when we in the playoffs is when we make the playoffs. We got to get there first. C come on, man. You know what I'm saying? Come on. Got to get there first. Or the championship. In which the case, the championship is the kingdom, man. So you got to get to the, you got to, if you want to get the championship, you got to get to the, you got to get past the regular season, right. as a brother stated, get to the playoffs, right. get to the conference and get to the Super Bowl, man. That's how it works. Right. If we can't run away from something that we haven't been to yet. <laughs> so that means brothers have to key in and do these foundations, these, these fundamental elements of the gospel in order to advance, man. Right. We, so we, we're, we're, the first one we're going to tackle on today is this baptism because unfortunately, a majority of brothers just got that all wrong, man. In Israel, they got it all wrong. If brothers are, are new, they're learning. Sisters are new, they're learning. That's great. And learn the name of Yahweh Shai, and you can move on to it. It's a lot easier for them. But I think it's a, it's definitely a stronghold for brothers who know that they're Israel. How y'all doing? How y'all going, y'all? For brothers that know that they're Israel, it's tough for them to break that stronghold and thinking that it was the word, man. Thinking it's just, oh, baptism is the word, and it's all good. Nah, man. It, the, the word is telling you what it is. This, this is the counsel of Yahweh, man. So we're going to go to, we're going to ask a question too, man. Because we want to always isolate the John's baptism. Let's, let's ask this question, man. Matthew 21 and 25. If you got it. God, I got it right here. Come. I got it right there. <clears throat> this is Matthew 21 and 25. The baptism of John. Whence uh -huh. was it? Uh huh. What, which was it? What, where was the baptism of John from? Was it from heaven? Uh huh. Or of men? Which one is it? Most brothers. That, that's that's it. And they reason with themselves, saying, Uh huh. If we shall say from heaven, uh -huh. he will say unto us, Why did ye not then believe him? Hmm. Come on. But if we say of men, we fear the people. 
for all hold John as a prophet. Come on, man. Come on. And they answered what Jesus. Is uh -huh. And they answered Jesus and said, Slaki. And they answered Yahweh Shah and said, We cannot tell. And he said unto them, Neither tell I you by what authority I do these things. Come on, I, he threw that question in front of them to say, because he knew they wouldn't accept, he knew they wouldn't accept it, man. He right. threw that question in front of them saying, where, where is it from, man? Because he knew they'd be confounded. Right. He knew that, he knew that already, man. They, they would have, they would have an internal conflict. Right. Man, if we say the, the, the baptism that John did was of, of heaven, like, how come he didn't believe in me? Yeah, how, I'm Yahweh Shah, how can you didn't believe in it? Okay. And if, and if they say answer, hey, no, it's not, it's from me, the people's gonna have an uproar because they knew that was the gospel, man. Okay. You know, so you, you can't have it both ways, man. Like, we, brothers will agree, brothers will agree that the baptism of John was from heaven, right? It says that in the scripture, right. verbatim. No one disagrees with it, okay? So now how is it a custom? It can't be a custom or an option if this was ordained by Yahweh, man. There's no, we can't do that. This is the counsel of Yahweh, uh, Isaiah 46 and 10. This is the counsel of Yahweh, man. You're gonna bring it back. You don't wanna reject this. You reject this, you reject in the counsel of Yahweh. Uh, Isaiah 46 and 10. 46 and 10. Uh. Con. This is Isaiah 46 and 10. Mm -hmm. Declaring the end from the beginning. Uh -huh. And from ancient times, the things that are not yet done, saying, uh -huh. My counsels shall stand. Come on. And I will do all my pleasure. Come on, man. Mike, the same from the end, from the beginning. To, Come on, the end, man. To the end. In the beginning, beginning to end, man. And my counsel will stand. My counsel will stand. This yeah. is the counsel of Yahweh, man. We go, if we go over to Luke 7 and 28, we're going to find out how that counsel precepts. What's going on, brother? Feel free to stop by, man. Feel free to stop by. What's going on, sister? Hey, how are you? Doing good. We're over here just giving the word out. Yeah, you need, you need to stop by and hear us. I will. Let me finish. Okay. I'll come back. Okay, come on. We'll hold yeah, I'll come back too, bro. I went to school with you, didn't I? You did. No, you sorry. did. I'm remembering your face, Oscar yeah, yeah. Smith. No, did you, you ever go to North State? I didn't go to North State. Okay. Well, I know you yeah, I feel like, yeah, it's yeah, familiar, yeah. man. Yeah. What y'all doing? What y'all got going on? We're over here preaching the word, man, because the injustice, yeah. yeah, this injustice that's happened amongst our people, yeah. the protests and everything, we get where the, where the sincerity is coming from, yeah. but we got to understand the solution. We want to educate our people on the solution uh -huh. that of what it's going to take for us to truly get peace, and it's not going to be from protesting for people who never gave a damn about us in the yeah. first place, man. I agree with all that. You know what I mean? We got, we got, we got to get back with our, with our power, man, yeah. with our mo mm -hmm. with the most high. That's facts, yeah. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? So if we don't get back with the most high, yeah. through your Howard, through your Howard shot, mm -hmm. or, or the Lord and Savior, who you would right. know is Jesus. Right. Yeah. yeah. Um, then, then we're going to be long. We're going to continue to keep going through things until we, until we all as a collective call on his name. Yeah. I agree 100%. Yeah. I know she saved my life. And I mean, I see what's going on in the world right now. And like you said, we lost. Yeah. And it's a whole bunch of confusion. Yeah. So y'all yeah, right about that 100. percent And that's why they call the, the uh, United States the uh, city of uh, daughter of Babylon. The daughter of Babylon, the but it's the land of confusion. Uh, Babylon right. means confusion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You said you gonna run back right here? Yeah. I'm, 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 Please do, brother. I got yeah. You. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Uh, Isaiah 46 and 10. Oh, yeah, we did that. Luke 7 and 28. Slocky. Oh, yeah, that's what I was at. Yeah, Luke that's what you were looking at. Slocky, slocky, y'all. Luke 7 and 28. Luke 7, 28. Con, this is Luke 7, verse 28. Uh-huh. For I say unto you, among those that are born of women, yeah. there is not a greater prophet than John the Baptist. Come on, there was no greater prophet. That, that was a reason why that was said, man. And this is also from his works due to being Elias, uh, Elijah as well, man. So we can, we can, hey, man, there was no greater work, the prophet than John the Baptist. But he that is least in the kingdom of Yahweh is greater than he. Uh-huh. And all the people that heard him and the publicans 
justified Yahweh, uh -huh. being baptized with the baptism of John. No, like they was baptized with the word. The baptism of John. Come on, man. That means the baptism of John what means that they actually, we all agree that the baptism of John was brothers and sisters being baptized in water. In water. So he bat, he was he was ordained to baptize Yahweh Shah. Yeah. So he he didn't baptize Yahweh Shah with the word. Come on, man. He baptized him with water. Come on, man. Okay. Oh, 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 by the way, by the way, this is, Yahweh Shah is already on the scene. Yeah, so for y'all that's saying that Yahweh Shai, um, after he stepped on the scene, after he got baptized, that this was over with, if that's the case, then why is he still doing it? Why is he still baptizing other brothers and sisters? This is what Yahweh Shai right there, the gospel is being preached. It's already being preached. Keep that in mind. They're hearing him out. And then after this gospel is being preached, now they're getting baptized in the name uh, in the name of Yahweh Shai, but the baptism of John. Time. Come on, man. Like in water. If it was if it was null and void, why is John still doing a work that is null and void in front of the Lord and Savior? <laughs> why is it I don't make sense to me? Time. Time. <laughs> hey, keep it going. Keep it going. So I, uh, I, was, I was I was gonna say if he didn't if he didn't baptize him in water, right? Yeah. And then it's by the word, then how come it says he was baptized with the baptism of John? Come on, man. If if it was just of the word, it would that, they wouldn't even have put that in there. Exactly. Am I right? It, con. Okay. Con. So I get it. Verse 30. No slack. Hey um, sister, come here south. Yeah, yeah. All the people that heard him and the publicans and justified. Well, I already read that slot. Here. Verse 30. Keep it going. But the Pharisees and lawyers rejected the counsel of Yahweh against themselves. The counsel of who? The counsel of Yahweh. Come on, man. Against themselves. Against themselves. Being not baptized of him. Come on, man. And Yahweh said, Where unto them shall I liken the men of this generation. There we go. That's what's up. That's it. So yeah, man, like the, the Pharisees rejected because it, it wasn't formed. They are not the children of Yahweh, man. They are the children. They're Israel. They're Israelites, but they are not of the children of Yahweh. They weren't ordained for this. We all know that. Huh. Pharisees weren't chosen for this. So when they rejected the council, they rejected the council of Yahweh. They didn't just say, "Ah, oh, brother, I don't want to go into water." They said, "We don't want to deal with the council of Yahweh." Huh. Now, they may have thought they were doing the right thing, some of them. Some of them may have thought they were doing the right thing by rejecting that, right? They weren't. I thought I was going to keep my hair all my life, but you see what happened, right? Because, <laughs> <laughs> man. As we just say in the military, you think long, you think wrong. Mm. You thought too long, everybody. Mm. So, yeah, man, that's the counsel of Yahweh that is spoken of. Um, and you must be baptized in water in the name of Yahweh Shah for the remission of sins. There's no other way around it, man. Uh -huh. Um Shoot, and this is this is what this was preordained. As we were speaking to a brother we was talking about before, we was talking to him earlier. This was something that was preordained. If we go to Luke um, one and thirteen, Luke one and thirteen. God, this is Luke one and thirteen. But the angel said unto him, Fear not, Zacharias, for thy prayer is heard, and thy wife Elizabeth shall bear thee a son uh -huh. and thou shalt call his name John uh huh it's a preordaining of John the Baptist he's already being told the angel's telling him that John the Baptist is going to be born amongst Elizabeth who was barren and thou shalt have joy and gladness and many shall rejoice at his birth uh huh for he shall be great in the sight of Yahweh and shall drink neither wine nor strong drink and he shall be filled with the Holy Ghost even from his mother's womb. Come on, man. And many of the children of Israel, uh -huh. and many of the children of Israel shall he, he be turned to Yahweh, our power. Come on, so that, that's showing that he was preordained. He had a mission. He had a mission he had to accomplish. Uh -huh. So that the John the, the baptism of John is not something like that it was just for all that to happen right and and this this large message this wasn't something like to be taken man this wasn't not, so oh, God, God. 
Yeah, go ahead. What you got? What you got? No, nah, this, this ain't no joke, man. Yeah, it this was ain't a, no joke. I'm going to just come here, baptize a couple people, and, you know, I'm going to baptize, you know, our Lord and Savior, granted, the Yahweh Shai, and then, then this baptism is just completely just done away. We don't do it anymore. It was, it's not, it's not uh, symbolism or, or uh, what's, what's the other word they like to use? It's symbolism or it's... Uh, yeah. It's, 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 it's not done, it's not... You don't have to do it physically. Metaphorically, yeah. Right, it's yeah. better, yeah. Yeah, yeah, it, no, it, it, it's a symbolic act. It's symbolic, that's it's, what Yeah, it's, it's a symbolic act, but it's not symbolic in the sense of you're replacing water with anything else, with man. the word. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah, you're not replacing water. It's a symbolic act. But yeah, like now, the word is said. part of it now. Don't get me wrong. Yeah, yeah, you the word is part of it. Yeah. But you have to come up with a new man. You're not going to come up with a new man just by the word. You know what I'm saying? I mean, you can, but the first part is the wet water baptism. Yeah, yeah, and, and the transition into into becoming a new man. Another trans part of the transition is the word S sanctification. Then, sanctification. That's the, by fire. See, that's that's the problem. See, that's the problem. A lot of brothers and sisters want to go through. They're doing the sanctification part first, huh. and then uh, not even not even then. They're saying the sanctification is what's going to justify them being in the kingdom, and you can't justify yourself by keeping the law to get into the kingdom. Okay, so my my question to that would be. If if Yahweh Shai did it, mm -hmm. if the disciples did it, mm -hmm. then what makes us so great that we don't have to do it? That would be my question. Ding. Bingo. I mean, are we supposed to follow? We, we supposed to follow the principles and, and what Yahweh Shai did while he was on his earth. Come on, now. So if he got baptized by water, then what what makes us different not to be baptized by water? Come on, now. I, the, I, I don't, I don't, I can't yeah. grasp that. Ah, come yeah. on, man. At, at bare minimum, you would do this because your Lord and Savior did it and you're doing it out of faith in his name. God. Uh, and, 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 that, and that's just all there is to it. If he did it, it's an example. That's the ultimate example. We shouldn't need anything else, right? Right. It's the ultimate example. Right. Like, and, and don't say nothing about uh, brothers be coming out here insincere saying, oh, well, he died on the cross too. So shouldn't we go on the cross too? But, Brother, right. no. Br I'll tell you what though. I will tell you what though. I mean, we, we're not gonna go on the. Well, I got you. We're not gonna go on the cross. Ah, he did it. Right. But there's also, you know, in the times it did say that, right? Where the Yahweh Shai said, "Hey, man, there's gonna be elect members that will be taken and put to death." So they got their own version of the cross, and they're gonna be put to death too, man. Like the guillotine. Yeah, yeah man. We gotta go through. There's gonna be things we gotta go through, man. Other other forms of torture. Brothers, are, come on. Yeah, it's it's heavy. It's heavy, man. So, so let's not let's let's not do that. Let's just be sincere, brothers. Let's be very sincere about the situation, and let's not do like cats and run away from this water, man. Right. Let's do this. Well, all brothers and sisters that believe in Yahweh Shai must be baptized in His name in water. And I, yeah, we we being aggressive about it today, maybe because of, you know the protest is out and everything, but we are also very adamant about brothers and sisters' salvation on these things. Uh, you know what I'm saying? This is very souls on the line. people's souls on the line, man. This is real out here, man. It's, it's cranking up, and we're running out of time to be able to do these acts. <laughs> As in the book of Acts, it was happening. Uh, you know what I mean? Let's get, let's get uh, Mark 1 through 4. Hey. You know, it's been itchy out here, man. I know, right? <laughs> so that's that pollen, man. That pollen, yeah, it's good. Uh, is it Mark? Yeah, first Mark, well, one, excuse me, Mark chapter 1. Um, one through four, or four through eleven. It's locking. Four through eleven. Yeah. Mark one and four. <clears throat> this is Mark four and one. No, one and four. I mean, one locking. <laughs> one yeah, doing. and four. Yeah. John did baptize in the wilderness. Uh huh. And preached the baptism of repentance for the remission of sins. Uh huh. So that means your sins will be remitted when you get baptized. In the name now is going to be in the name of Yahweh Shai. At the time before Yahweh Shai showed up, he was just baptizing him as a prelude to show what it was going to be when the Lord and Savior, before the Lord and Savior stepped onto the scene. Right. Uh huh. Verse five. Then, and there went out unto him all the land of Judea and they of Jerusalem, and were all baptized of him, John, in the river. Of Jordan mm -hmm. confessing their sins. Mm -hmm. Hold on, let me, let me read that verse again. Uh, there it. went out unto him all the land of Judea, they of Jerusalem, 
and were all baptized of him, John the Baptist, mm -hmm. in the river Jordan, confessing their sins. Mm -hmm. Not the word. Mm -hmm. Jordan, right, so Jordan had water in it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, it's just, that's what it is. They would confess, the, the children would be confessing their sins amongst John. This is before Yahweh Shai arrived on the scene when he was just doing it simply for the remission of sins. Huh. When Yahweh Shai comes on the scene, now you'd be baptized in the name of Yahweh Shai. Huh. Um, as we get that, was as stated in <laughs> the book of Matthew, uh, book of Matthew 28 and 18, man. I'll get, I'll get this, I'll get this one. You get, uh, get Mark 16 and huh. 15. All right. This is Yep. This is the book of Matthew, chapter 28, verse 18. And Yahweh Shai came and spake unto them, saying, All power is given unto me in heaven and in earth. Go ye therefore and teach all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Ghost. Now if we go into the if you go into the Greek and the transcripts of it, it's really saying baptize, make disciples, and baptize them in my name. But they're all on one accord, so we understand they're all on one accord. But you're baptizing people in the name of Yahweh Shai for the remission of sins. Che teaching them to observe all things whatsoever I have commanded you. And lo, I am with you always, even to the end of the world. Amen. So, brothers and sisters, got to be baptized in the name of Yahweh. Y'all sisters can come and hear us if y'all want to hear the word out. All right. It's going to be tough. Ba getting baptized in the name of Yahweh Shai for the remission of sins. So, therefore... Everything that you've done, your sins can be remitted, and you can start off with a clean slate, man. But look, see, people, people don't want to do that. See. This, this, this is what, what, what I don't get. You know what I'm saying? Why would you sit up here and you already see that the prophecies are coming to fruition? They, they, I mean, it's happening. You can see it, and you still want to sit here and, and not even listen to the word, man? Are you serious? This ain't no game, yo. This this is not a game. This ain't no, oh, I got time. I got another 10, 15. No, we don't. I'd be surprised if we have another year and a half or six months. This could happen. I mean, you know what I'm saying? You don't know when it's going to happen. So this, know, this, 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 ain't, this ain't nothing to play with, man. Sorry that I might seem well, as nah, but this is crazy. That's right, you're saying, God. Why people just keep walking by and don't want to hear it? Especially Jake. Our old people. <laughs> Jake. I mean, come we lost, man. And, we, and this is why we're going to keep doing... We have no other direction to go. The Most High has put the Spirit upon our people who are not seeking Him to go right and do a, a bunch of things. But you're asking you're asking the enemy for help. You're asking the enemy to stop being your enemy is what you're doing. And he's not going to do it. <laughs> That's just It's just point blank period. You're asking for justice, freedom, equality, the things we've asked for for over how many years, I over it's, it's over it's a decade no o over eons right man how, how long have we been asking for this and it's never happened <laughs> ever since <laughs> this is not what happened hey don't y'all understand the definition of insanity is to keep doing the same thing over, over, and, and, over, and, over. and expect the same uh different results man it's not as no matter how many times i do two plus two i'm always going to get four so y'all, y'all brothers and sisters, like, gotta understand where this is coming from, man. We gotta understand this is where we gotta go. Let's try something different. We ain't trying to come to the true word of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shah. Let's. That's why we speak, but that's why we also speak, and we understand that there's an elect that will receive this word, and salvation is only for the elect, God. not for all Israel, because all Israel is not going to receive this. But, but here's my question. Uh huh. They walk out here, and it's 90, 94 degrees out here, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. But and they'll walk ten miles. Yeah. Right. Yeah. For for you know for uh, the protest. Yeah. But you can't take five minutes to hear the bike. You stay out there for two hours walking in, in, in 90, 90, four degree weather. Yeah. And can't listen to the scriptures for five minutes. Con. Con. Wow. That, con. That's a valiant point, man. Wow. That's the point. What we. Sit right here. Hey, you want to say you want to send in the shade? We'll move it to the side, man. Well, we just want to help our people understand the, the truth and solution to overcoming what we're dealing with. How you doing, sister? Hey, overcoming what we're dealing with here. And if y'all want to pro understand 
where the protest is coming from. But if you want the true solution, you got to come back to this word, man. You got to come back to the, the true version of this word, not your Sunday church. How you doing, brother? What's going on, bro? Hey, you want hey, you want to stop by here or something? Hear the word? All right. It's, it's going to get bad out here later, all right? I said, hey, all this events that's going down right now, it's going to get worse, bro. See? So, <laughs> it is what it is, bro. See what I'm saying? Yeah. So, you, 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 play, you play ball hot as it is out here. And you can't listen to the work of fire. This is Jake, man. That's Jake. Stiff neck and rebellious people, man. And, 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 the, and the thing is, you probably like, right. you know what? You guys are crazy, man. They, they, they don't know what they're talking about. But yeah. hey, once, I guarantee you, once, once the famine of the word hits, you know, hey, the brothers that was at the park, man. Where, where, where they at? Where they at? Mm -hmm. Find us. What's going on? Ain't so, find us. Yeah, ain't gonna find us, bro. It's gonna too deep. It's gonna be too deep out here, man. Yeah, yeah. Right. Get, get that mark. Uh, hey, hey, oh, and so we, that's why, brother, we try and get this now because who knows? Like he said. When all these stuff hits, man, when all this stuff hits and you can't go to a crib, you can't say, hey, Uncle Johnny, let me go to your crib and just and chill, kick and drink some liquor, man. Or or let's let me let me pull up to Aunt Susan's house, man. Let me pull up to my I can't you can't pull up to your own mom's crib, man. You can't go see your girl. Well, you can't pull up and drive and meet with your companions, your fellow brothers and sisters out here, man. And now you're looking for the this goes for all people, like uh, whether they understand their Israel or not. If you when you when you need the baptism. What's going to happen then when everything is shut down and we can't do that, man? We're trying to do that now because we, it's going to be a time we understand. We ain't going to be able to do that, man. Right. Across the four corners of the earth. Right. So we got to make, because this is what's going to happen. For, for, for brothers who don't believe you must be baptized in water and who don't seek it. And for those who just seek, don't seek the word at all, we got Mark, bring it out, man. Mark 16 and 15, man. What's going to happen? If, tell them what's going to happen if you, don't, um, if you don't get baptized into the council of Yahweh in the name of Yahweh Shai. He that believeth and is baptized and is baptized shall be saved. Oh no, he that it says he that believeth and shall preach the gospel. He that believeth and is and is baptized shall be saved. He that believeth and loves everybody. He that believeth and is baptized and is baptized. Oh, one more, I'm sorry, I, one more time. He that believeth and is all Israel is Israel. All that believeth and is baptized uh -huh. shall be saved. So you got to believe in Yahweh Shai, not a Jesus in the Sunday churches. You got to believe in Yahweh Shai and you got to be baptized shall, shall be, saved. be saved. You got to be baptized. And believe it. You got to believe and be baptized. You need that combination. You got to do both, man. Because if you, if you if you believe, right, you're going to get baptized. Right. Yeah, it's, it's no different. That's an initiation, bro. I say this to brothers all the time. How you doing, brother? What's going on, man? You can stop by and hear the word, man. The, the initiation is to be baptized in the name of your house child. Just This is a righteous, hey, man, this, we talk to brothers all the time. What's going on? This is a righteous gang, man. Like, brothers that, uh, like, in, in a gang, right, even from a gang standpoint, code, they're not going to let you just get into the gang without whooping your ass first, man. Blood in, blood out. Come on, man. So you gotta believe. So this is this is the initiation to believe in him, and you're gonna do that baptism. You're gonna do that because you believe in Yahweh Shah so much. You believe that he rose on the third day. You believe that he died for his people, right? For the remission of their sins. You believe that he's the Lord and the Savior, man. So you believe so much that you are going to go into that water and come back out. We ain't say you going We ain't gotta throw you in the Pacific Ocean, man. See if you're gonna sink or swim. It ain't. It ain't that serious, man. It ain't like that. This is a simple act. Start up a tub, get in the pool. It's hot out here. It's 91 degrees. Get you some water and get baptized in his name, man. And come back up. Now you're walking as a new man, a new woman, man. In your Howard Shah's name, man. Be baptized for the mission of sin so you have a chance to be saved. A chance. A chance to be saved. You got a fighting chance. Con. Con. Hey, good point. You got we, a fighting chance. We, we, we're not. Yeah. And it says also, Salaki, I'm going to finish the uh, script from Keep the it verse. Going. Keep it going. But he that believe it, not shall be damned uh, no Aki if you if they believe you believe if not you're still gonna get the kingdom anyway because you Israel he that believeth not shall be damned that's it you're through that's what that's what the word is it's saying red letter. that's what the red, red letter. letter that's your how is y'all speaking you don't believe him who else you gonna believe huh 
which we established that's the council of Yahweh. Y'all know by Deuteronomy 18 that he speak that prophet um going in, he was speaking. <laughs> In, in the 18th verse, we were yeah. speaking, man. Yeah. He was talking about Yahweh Shai. Believe on that prophet's words, man. Yeah. We know that, man. So if you don't, if, if you don't do this, you, you're not giving yourself a chance. Even because we're not even saying that us brothers, us brothers that have been baptized in the name of Yahweh Shai for the mission of sins, we don't even know if we're gonna make it. So how much Lord more, willing. Lord willing, we have, Lord right? Willing, Lord willing, we pray we are that elect. But if we don't know, how much more for y'all brothers that didn't do it? Or don't believe in it. You know? Because if you believe in Yahweh Shai, you are going to do this. If you be truly believe in that Lord and Savior and truth and sincerity, this is what you're going to do, man. Otherwise, you're going to pay the consequences for it. Your resume is automatically thrown off the table, man. Oh, ba no baptism? It's out, man. The how book of life, man. You ain't got no life. How about this? We could be wrong, even though I don't think we are. But, 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 ain't wrong. but what if we write? Right? Yeah. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. Because they thinking, oh, they, they don't know what they're talking about. Huh. Now, what if we are right? Huh? And Yahweh Shah come back. They say, Yahweh Shah, you know what I'm saying? I was out there on the highways, the byways. I put in the work. I followed the Lord's statutes and commandments to the best of my ability. Mm -hmm. And then he'll ask you, did you get baptized in my name? Think about it. Oh, man. Ooh. Think about it. When you sat up there and y'all said, oh, you built. Y'all, them brothers don't know what they're talking about. They novice. They, they low level. They low level. But what if we're right? Even though I know we're right. But what <laughs> if we're right? And he comes back and asks you that question. You out there in the highways and byways, yeah. You know what I'm saying? And I'm not knocking that. I'm not saying you're wrong. But what if we're right? And he asks you, did you get baptized in my name for the remission of the sins? Think about that. You're going to say, yeah, I, I baptized. I heard your word. I didn't. No, you didn't, that, you didn't get baptized in my name. No. And you're gonna, then you're going to try to go to whoever your teachers are, your elders or whoever it is that taught you this. And you're going to try. But you know that's not going to work. You know that that's the how is not having that. He ain't going to let you. How is ain't having that? They ain't going to let that happen, man. You going you believed on another man instead of believing in his word. Oh, here's another question. What if your elders did get baptized in the name of your Shah but didn't tell you? Think about that. Well, they also doing false doctrine, too. That means they would still be held accountable, too, for the false doings they're doing. And this is why, and this is why we say... Because I, I, a, a lot of brothers address this, the Christ, you know, they want to go to the Christian church and say, "Oh, we've seen brothers come out still looking, doing what they did when they went in water." For one, they did it in the name of Jesus. Okay, that's why we emphasis to say, "Baptize in the name of Yahweh Shai, not Jesus Christ, man, or any other name for that matter, a Shai, whatever you want to come up with." Yeshua, Yeshua, Yahushua, yeah. Yehuda, whatever, man. Hey, man, it's baptized in the name of Yahweh Shai for the remission of sins, man. They haven't done that. So that's one. Strike one. They ain't done that. Two, we're not saying the baptism itself is going to save you by going in water. We're not saying the water saves you. We are saying, according to the scriptures, what the scriptures are saying is that in order to do this, this is how you have a chance to get fighting a fighting chance. See, doesn't mean we're going to make it in the kingdom. Doesn't mean it. No, Lord willing, we do. But like I said, we, we go on, we follow the example of Yahweh Shah. You know what I'm saying? So, hey, I'm not I'm not better than Yahweh Shah. So I know if he did it, I'm gonna do it. Yeah, I'm doing my best, of my best, of my mm -hmm. to my to the best of my ability. So I can to follow in his footsteps. I'm all, I know I'm in his flesh, and I'm a fool, and I'm gonna keep asking for you know, keep repenting and mm -hmm. asking for forgiveness because I know I'm a fool. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I'm not. You know, I, I'm gonna strive to be perfect, but I'm a fool. All do so, you know. Been baptized in the name of Yahweh Shai, at least I got a fighting chance. You have you know a fighting saying? chance, man. Give your, chance. give your, that's what we're asking Israel. How you doing, brother? Doing come, good. come and hear us out if you got time, man. Come and hear us out if you got a little bit of time, man. I right, said, so just come and hear us out for a little bit if you got a little bit of time, like two to five minutes or something, man. What are you talking about? We're going into this word, baptism. man. We're going to, yeah, we're going specifically we're talking about baptism in the name of Yahweh Shai. Uh, we're talking about the word, man. I, I, I understand. Well, I'm, I actually, we're not in a hurry, but I know I'm actually on another time now. Okay. Yeah. All right. No problem. So you got to do it, man. We over here, look, we're looking for the lost sheep of the house. Of, looking for the lost sheep of the house of Israel as, as uh, Yahweh Shai did, man. It is what it is, man. You could See, and even with that, that would have been cool. If, I understand he's on a time constraint, but he could have been like, yo, let me get, you know what? I want to hit, let me get your number. Let's do something. You got a Facebook. You got something we communicate because I got to go, but... Didn't do nothing. What time they said the park closed? 8 30. 
So you got almost two hours. And he's on time limit? The park ain't closing. Yeah. Well, what kind of time limit is he on? Yeah. Yeah, man. There ain't no time limit for the most high, man. As far as listening to the word and, and, and getting the knowledge, you know what I'm saying, the law, statutes, and commandments, you know what I'm saying? Ain't no, it's now, yo. You ain't got time. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Ain't no, you ain't got time like that. Yeah, time's, time's gonna be out real fast, man. Time's gonna be done with real fast, bro. Because if you see it with a spiritual eye, we ain't got much time left, man. This this, y'all, this beginning of Jacob's truck. The beginning. The very, we didn't even, yeah, scratch the surface. Yeah, we didn't even scratch the surface. Hey, man, uh, Acts, Acts 13 and 23. Yeah. through 24. Yeah, yeah, man, don't be damned, man, because there is, as it says, how you doing that? As it did say in Hebrews 6 and 1 through 2, it is talking about, um, it is, there is an eternal judgment in there. Very controversial, another controversial topic amongst Israel, but it did say eternal judgment. We're not going to get into that, but it did say that right in the scriptures. We're not going to get into that right now, but there is a place of eternal judgment according to the word. And if you don't do these things, you don't have these foundations, these principles. You just you're a brother that or your brother that knows prophecy, and you can probably jump all over the book and drum circles around prophecies. But where's 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 the code? Where's the principles, man? Where's the fundamentals at, man? This is like basketball, man. Yeah. Hey. Come so on. people have, might have that natural talent to be able to dribble the ball, but and, and dunk and stuff like that. But some people you got to you got to start from from somewhere. You got to have a foundation. You know what I'm saying? Just because you got handles, that mean you ain't got no jump shot. You gotta have that basics on everything. Know how to do layups, game, man. man. Know how to do layups. Layups, you know what I'm saying? Rebound, you know what I mean? Come on, man, footwork, man, it's key, man. Nah. Yeah. Acts 13, 23. 23. Yeah. Of this man's seed, half your hour, according to his promise, raised unto Israel, a savior, Yahweh Shai. Oh, well, read that again, Ock. Of this, hold on, you, you want to go back up one? No, it's 23. Because they're talking about King David, by the way. The promise to King David. Of King David's seed, of this, of this man's seed, half Yahweh, according to his promise, raised unto Israel a savior, Yahweh Shai. Mm hmm. Keep going, go to 24. Keep it going. Verse 24. When John had first preached before his coming the baptism of repentance to all the people of Israel. Oh, so so that means that I mean, that's twice. That's twice. So that means this baptism, what's going on, man? That means this baptism was for John the Baptist to give to the repentance of the Israel, to even firmly establish that this was something given to Israel to do. Why would he just take it away after like Yahweh Shah shows it. Why would he just take it away and say this is no longer done anymore? This act is no longer necessary to do this. Huh. It don't make sense. It don't make sense. You know? Uh, That's why we're in the situation we're in now. Yep. Because we, we fell away from all everything that was taught to us, we just went away from. Went away from. You know what I'm saying? Yep. And 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 by not doing those things, you know what I'm saying, not just pick and choose what this is what's supposed to be done, or this is what's supposed to be done. If you do everything, or you know, do do everything to the best of your ability, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, at least you got a fighting chance. Well, I mean, yeah. Come on, man. I don't know, man. I, I, I don't like, especially when it comes to this this, this word, man. Coming from your Howard, through your Howard side. I don't play around with it, man. I ain't, I ain't gonna sit up here and, and play with people's souls. So. Yeah. I'm not gonna do For real, it. man. I'm not gonna do That's it. what's happening. Hey, look, and, and, and it could some, there's some brothers that believe this sincerely, so I, I'm not really, but it still needs to be said. I'm not, I'm, it's different when we're talking to brothers that are doing this sincere and when brothers that are doing this off of their own, um, their own greed, their own lust, like it's the scripture said, their own uh, belly. Uh, but at the same time, it still needs to be brought out for y'all to hear, even if you, especially if you're doing it sincerity, you'll see that these scriptures is telling you to be baptized in water when there's so many examples of it, which we'll, we'll get into those in another lesson. Lord willing, we'll be able to get into that into another lesson. We just want to right now establish, you know, uh, of getting baptized yeah, yeah, the, the baptism is a commandment because we hear that a lot. It's it is a commandment, 
and then on, it's not optional. <laughs> and then on top of that, what it's for? What does it mean? What does it symbolize? So you're not just thinking, so brothers are being carnal, thinking this is just talking about water. It's talking about being your sins being remitted, so you have a chance out of this place, man. Uh, Acts, I got, I got you. I got Acts two and thirty-eight out. Uh, you give me Acts three and nineteen. All right, so now I'll, I'll start off with this. Start, I'll start off with 36. Therefore, let all the house of Israel know as surely that Yahweh had made that same Yahweh Shai, whom ye have crucified both Lord and Hamashiach. Now when they heard this, they were pricked in their heart and said unto Peter and to the rest of the apostles, Men and brethren, what shall we do? So they're asking, what shall we do? They're, they're in their, they were conflicted in their hearts. They wondering, man, what do we got to do, man? What shall we do? And he tells them. Then Peter said unto them, Repent and be baptized, every one of you, in the name of Yahweh Shai Hamashiach for the remission of sins. Hold on. Did he say, Get baptized in the name of Yahweh Shai? Huh? Peter said unto them, Repent and be baptized, every one of you, in the name of Yahweh Shai Hamashiach for the remission of sins, that ye shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. And, and Peter's already Mind you they're saying what shall we do Because Peter's already been preaching to these These people right. he's already told them So if that was the case the brother, the brother we're going to get further than that He could have just stopped man He could have just stopped right there that, that, that's, that's, that, it. that's it that's the, that's the, that's, You've been baptized right, right. right. <laughs> Even in 28 That we brought it says preach the gospel You know what I'm saying if you, had, if you already preaching it to them then that should be the bat that's the baptism in itself, right? But he's saying preach and baptize, belief and baptize. Uh -huh. It's a combination, man. Steps. Steps. Yes. See, if you're not gonna get baptized in his name if you don't believe, that's something to think about. A, a, someone who does not believe in Yahweh Shai is not going to get baptized in his name. So, some distinctifications on this. Hopefully, this pricks some, bro some brothers and sisters' hearts that they may be baptized in the name of Yahweh Shai before it's too late to do that. Uh -huh. Um, hey, it's coming quick, man. Huh? Once, once Jacob's trouble really starts popping off, <laughs> look for us. Good luck. Zero to one hundred, real quick. Real quick. <laughs> Don't let the gray hairs on his face fool you. Come on, he man. Still can move, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But what's going on, bro? Ain't hey, much, man. Time. This is X. Three. And 19. Uh -huh. Repent ye therefore and be converted that your sins may be blotted out mm -hmm. when the time of refreshing shall come from the presence of Yahweh. Come on, man. So that's what we talked about. You need your sins to be blotted out. So when you pull up on when judgment day happens, which I, and there's gonna be there's gonna be judgment day when this when this purge stuff happens, there's gonna be judgment for it. What, when you actually have to deal with the Heavenly Father, which is going to be scary, man. That's going to be scary. So you don't want your, your chart, your sins list of chart to be held up to the top, man. You want to be converted. Brothers and sisters need to hear to the word so they can be baptized in the name of Yahweh Shai. Okay. That's your first step. Okay. So that's what we're trying to convince our people to do, you know, is to do that. Those that believe will do this. You know what I'm saying? That shows, man. And I, that, an elect member, those of the elect, will do this. They will do this. If they're of the elect, they will do this action. Because they believe in Yahweh Shah, man. Huh. Something in their spirit of making them be like, hey, bro, I, I got to get this done. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. The spirit be quick. Huh. Romans, uh, Romans 6. Romans 6 and 1. Yeah, man, and, and we we talked to brothers, man. Talked to brothers and sisters, and they said even said they did it, and then they're, they're putting it off, and it's taking forever. And oh, I, I, I get done. I, I'll call you back. Yeah, I'll yeah call you, you back. Or I'll email you back. I haven't heard from. Them. Yep, and y'all gonna understand. Look, y'all got y'all want to do the best that y'all can. We understand that situations do pop up, and and dealing with everyday uh, life things that happen, and you got to maneuver. Totally get that, but. I got to tell you, man, like you, you want to make that on the top of your priority list and don't forget it. You got to make sure you remember, because if you forget to do something like that, now the time's coming. Now you're looking for your how, hey, save me. You ain't going to do it, man, because you rejected the counsel. 
You put it off. So he's gonna put you know what he's gonna do? He's gonna put you off forever. Then you always said to put him first. Then how he that's what he said, right? So baptism of the kingdom of God. And, and and seeking this, you know what I'm saying, seeking this word and, and seeking get you know what I'm saying, get baptized in the name of Yahweh Shai, you know, mission of sin. And man, that should be numero uno, whatever. Look. I was work, I'm working two jobs and I got it done. You know what I'm saying? Oh yeah, this brother, this brother, hey, we had to call with, with a brother on the phone. Um, how y'all was talking to him and he got we, we had a three-way. This brother came in, I was hey yo, what, what day's cool? Cause I was even I was I was guilty. I was Saturday, I was getting ready to go out of town, so I was thinking about doing a Saturday, but I couldn't. And the spirit just made me say, Hey man, you you, you available the next day? I say, yeah, I can do it the next day. I didn't even know the brother was really gonna show up. Hey, that brother pulled right up, man. The next day, I was like, oh, praises, man. He was serious, man. As soon as I got off the second job, yeah. I made a beeline to the brother crib. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Boom. Got baptized in the name of Yahweh Shah. All, been, 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 been a rap from there. All you know praises, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah, man. Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah. Man, and that's, and, that's, and that's a fact, man. So it's like, we, we got to take this thing seriously. We do got to move on it, especially now. Especially now. There's really no leeway to really even maneuver now. If you would have did this too, I mean, I, I don't condone it, but if, if you did this a little bit ago and trying to maneuver things, okay, it, it happens, fine, cool. But right now, it's, it's more evident than ever, especially if we're in a vicinity where brothers and sisters are around you and can get to you. And especially even if you're not, because we got a plan. We'll make it happen. Like, if, if brothers really sincerely want to do this, you know, holler, side, holler at us, and by the spirit, you know, by Lord willing, you know, we'll do what we got to do. We'll plan it out. We can, we can, we'll, we'll come up with some funds to make it happen. We want to see the elect get sealed, man. We need to. That has to happen before all this stuff goes down to get, to get us home, man. Lord willing. This is your house, man. Come on, man. This is what he commanded us to do. He didn't ask us to do this. He no. told us yeah. this is what we're supposed to do. I didn't, I didn't, yeah, I, I suggested to you, brothers, which you might want to think about doing. Okay. Can, <laughs> can, can I get some time? Nah, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> the end is, yo. People don't understand how, how, how serious with the situation, you know, how the situation is going to, going to, and it's so, it's so frustrating it's, it's for our brothers and sisters to sit up here, they just keep walking, and they, I know they hear what he's saying, and, and they're like, oh, well, you know, you got baptized in the name of JC, man, that's not his name, you know, you know, you know what Jesus means? Jesus means Earth Day. Earth Day. Gotta look up words, man. What's going on, yo? What's going on, yo? You don't Y'all wanna hear us real quick? Hear the word? No, I'm just You sure? Right, yo, stuff is gonna get crazy out here, sister. You see it right now. I uh, I don't think she do. She sure really do, man. Right, not, uh, people don't really get what's really gonna go down, man. We, we trying to do this from compassion for our people, man. Like, but it's, it's gonna go down, man. And, and, and hey, man. Like, like I said, they, they gonna be like, Two brothers out there at the park, you know what I'm saying? You know, hey, we got, we, maybe they'll be out there and, and, and all kind of mayhem and stuff going on, rounds flying and, and stuff getting blown up and all that. Other people running around here crazy, like like in the purge. Nah, I'm not coming out here. For, no. Yeah, man. No, why? Why is the surface as soft as it does, right? Yeah, man. If it is his, I'm not going to sit up here and try to take it for myself. Yeah, it's going to be grand theft auto on him. Every uh, every other car that you see, you might like that car. So I got to take that, hey, drop him out the car. That's what that's what the cops is doing. That's what military forces is going to be doing, man. Let me get that. I need that, sir. Not even going to show you their badge. We bump the badge. They have, they, have, go. they have the right to confiscate military. I was in the military. They have the right to confiscate anything in the U.S. They they in the U.S. Armed forces. They declare that 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 the M law. You know what I'm saying? They can take anything they want. Car, anything. Take your house. They can take your car. They're definitely taking your funds. Yeah, but it's pretty soon we ain't gonna be able to access that unless you want to take the the R the vaccine slash R. I suggest you don't or that vaccine. But hey, and and, and see and see what's crazy? I, I hear a lot of people that will say. I'm not going to do that. I've asked them that, right? Just on a carnal level, I've asked them that. They'll say no. But here's the thing. If you don't have the, the rock, that rock, which is yeah, I was shy, shy, 
you're going to take that chip at some point. Or you could just die of a multi of causes for just for you just died because you didn't want to do it, but you're not going to receive the kingdom. You're still going to get that second judgment, man. If you're Israel, you're still going to get that second judgment. Uh, and it, it, hey, man, back, you're going to be brought back, and you will receive judgment, bro. It's, it, it's going to happen. Most highest words don't come back void. They don't you know come back void. Yeah, it's going to happen. Judgment is happening. Mm -hmm. Let's get a. Uh, you got that Roman six? Con, con, Roman, Roman six verse. Uh, start at one, right? Con, con. Hey, sister, it's locked out. Right. How you doing, sister? Hey, how you doing? Hey, we have a question for you real quick. Do you believe in the Bible? Are you, I don't know, you can hear us? I was like, yeah, how you doing, sister? Hey, do you believe in the Bible? I'm saved. You're saved? Okay. Well, here's the thing. We're trying to teach our people according to the word um, because what happens is we see, you see what's going on right now. Uh huh, and and with that thing in the seat up there, exactly. And, but we're not saved. That's the thing we're trying we're to. Not saved. Yeah, a lot of those people are not saved. And I mean, even even though we say, you know, we saved in the blood of, of you know, Jesus Christ. Yeah. But um, you know, it's, it's saved. He won't. We won't be saved until he comes back. He establishes order on earth. Because we are out of order. This, this, this whole planet, and I know you see this whole planet is. I know, and crazy. sometimes it's dark with home, it's dark with the kids, it's dark with taking orders. And a lot of us people don't want to take orders. We don't want to follow direction. We just stick with following direction, sticking to the commandments that's in the Bible. Huh. You know, I, I, I say we'll be better off. Um, we're not one nation no more. We don't even represent a pledge of allegiance to the flag. You know what I'm saying? Do, do it's none of that. No. I, I would never expect this world to turn out like it is. Oh, okay. it's in the scriptures. It's in the scriptures going to turn out like this. It's sad, and then some people, man, they out here doing wrong. They don't think they can do safe because it's still doing wrong. But it's like, just take a piece of paper and write down all your good, your blessing, write down all your bad. Still can't decide which, which direction to follow. And some people just don't want to accept the word because they can't follow the command. Yeah. Let's give up. Yeah. A lot of stuff. Yeah. And a lot of them probably follow me. They just don't think they can balance life and, and um, live a better life. That's all they know is how to live. That's true. And a lot. Of, here's a big thing. I'm gonna just be we're just have because we're having honest dialogue. You know what I'm saying? We have an honest dialogue. I used to be uh, I used to be deeply into the church to my ex. Mm. I See? I See? Up at the courthouse. See? I See? The telephone thread. Mm -hmm. I wear the long dresses, long skirts, shirt, all over. I, I never would be in my body. And this thing coming in all right on with G string. Yeah, what's going on, brother? Opposite. Stop by. Opposite. Man should never be alone with another man. At no time, if he's serving the Lord, he'll be something. 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 He'll it was him struggling with his faith. Mm -hmm. But he wanted to put on the suit, the tie, convince you, him, me. Well, he could quote those, those scriptures. But I tell you, his heart was not where his mind had when it comes to the Bible. Well, there you go. So I, 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 I stepped back. I mean, I could have got a year jail time to the Yeah, no, that's, that's good that you stepped yeah. yeah. uh, back. But, but here's, here's the thing we want to get into. Because a lot of our... Um, a lot of the teachings that happen to our people are false teachings. When you go to, I'm just being straight blunt. Now a lot of them are Muslims, you know. Yeah. I, I, I ain't gonna lie. 
Those Muslim people, boy, they worship it. Like, you can't crack them yeah. for nothing. My daughter won't take one. No, I said, girl, come on, leave that alone. Yeah. His eyes got all big. Like, he about to go off. I said, leave that alone. Yeah. Unless everybody was a servant of the Lord to accept Jesus Christ in their heart. And it's sad that they got to take the wrong path to find out what direction to go because the worst that can come from the city. Could be. But, and, and see, that's the thing. Here's the thing. Amongst that, even with the Muslim, right, there's all these different foundations, different elements to go worship. But here, hold on, one, one thing, sister. When it comes to the, when it comes to even the Sunday churches that we've been going to and taught by our pastors, that was false. For example, oh, yeah. small example, right? They'll tell you, oh, it's cool to go and eat pork. And it's not, according to the scripture. Shrimp, crab, lobster. Shrimp, crab, and lobster. Catfish. Yeah. I didn't know we mean the brother was just talking about that on the way up here. Yeah, hey, hey, there you go. Yeah, we was talking about that on the way up here, and uh, just imagine now they're, they're pretty much on the bottom, on the seafloor, right? And they wait until the fish, you know, relieve themselves, and they're just waiting. They, that's a free meal for them. Free meal. That's what they do. Clean up the, the seafloor. Got fish too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Man, oh, just like pigs. Just like pigs. They scavenge and eat their own stuff yeah. too amongst the earth. This is what we're talking about this is the bad food given to our slavery from the Bible. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's crazy. That's so we still eat the slave. Exactly. Right. That's that shows you the mentality of where we're at today so, as a whole people. So, How you doing, y'all? Hey. Y'all feel free to stop by too. We just we just preaching the word out here. Yeah. Uh oh. <laughs> but um, that's a misconception. Another misconception of our Lord and Savior is that He came to save every single person on the earth. He came for His people, the same people that need saving, like the ones that are getting shot unjustly, unrighteously. These same people, He's coming to save. He didn't come to save everybody because we don't need save. He don't need to save everybody. The people that are oppressing us. What do they need saving for? But think about this: the people that the, 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 um, the uh, not not the elite, like the Rothschilds, the Rockefellers, yeah. the international bankers. Do they need saving? They, they got the whole world. Mm -hmm. They don't need saving because they got the king. I mean, they got their king over here. Or they say they actually saved stuff. Exactly. So what did they be saved from? It, they said they be saved from, from hell. No, nah, well, see, that's a, that's a different thing of where people are supposed to, that's a different judgment for people. See, I, hell is an eternal judgment. Um, but what, what we've been taught was that there's different places for different sets of people. So for example, right, hell was actually a place for, you are familiar with the children of Israel, right? Yeah. Yep. The children of Israel that don't follow in the ways of the Lord and Savior and the Heavenly Father, right. that's what the place of hell is going to be for them. The okay. people that you, that we're talking about, the, the Rothschilds and all these people that yeah. oppress our people, right. they're, they're, you heard, you reap what you sow, right? Yeah. So guess what they got to do? They got to do the same things that we had to do. We had to be taken into captivity. Their family members were the ones that, that, that was part of the transatlantic slave trade. Mm -hmm. It's according to the word, no? Those um, that meet in the captivity shall go in the captivity. Be the with the sword. Give right. Jer Jeremiah. Let's get, let's get some word for it. Jeremiah 30 and 11. Start off with 11. It's going to tell you there's different repercussions for each uh, a nation of people. Our people, we are been selected by the Most High. Like, and I don't. When I say that, I don't just mean just by looking at your your skin complexion that you know that's it that's all there is to it we do identify our people do identify with these curses that are happening in this earth as you know while we're always in the back the bottom end we're in poverty right we're getting killed unjustly you said jeremiah, you said jeremiah. jeremiah 30 and 11 uh, so we identify those are our people but we're saying that if you are of our people you will believe in this word in truth and sincerity and come back this is Jeremiah 30 and 11. Yes. For I am with thee, mm -hmm. says Yahweh, to save thee, though I make a full end of all nations. Mm -hmm. Make a full end of thee, of Slakia. Whether I have scattered thee, uh -huh. 
yet I will not make a full end of thee. So he scattered us amongst all the different nations. So anytime you see all these different nations, when he's saying preach to all the nations, it's because our people, you can find our people everywhere, right? They're everywhere across, you know the, mean, across the earth. Everywhere. Yeah. Everywhere. Yeah. Four corners of the earth. Yeah. Uh, uh, um, but I will correct thee in measure and will not leave thee altogether unpunished. He punishes everybody as a nation. He don't just do like this. And you know, he does individual, but he, when he do like major punishing, he gonna do it as a nation. Just like we were punished as a nation to go into slavery. Mm -hmm. I can prove that we were on 28 and 60. Yeah, but keep going, keep going to that. Oh, one. So let's build more in there. Uh, for thus saith Yahweh, thy bruise is uncurable, incurable, so I can incurable. And thy wound is grievous. There is none to plead thy cause, that they that thou mayest be bound up. Sounds familiar. Nobody to bound up. There's nobody pleading for us. There's no one trying to help us we in have, this time. We, we have no government. We have no, no head. Nope. Nope. We're the only out, out of the United Nations. We're the only people that don't have a spot. Let's see. Who's that? Every nation that you see. Them. How far can you take your limit? Safe, right? Exactly. It's a mystery. It's a mystery, right? <laughs> yep. Started with my grandmother, but I don't know much about yes. my grandmother. You can't go back 2,000 years ago, can you? Nope. But the people in England can. The people in, in Iran, Iraq, Saudi Arabia, they can trace their limits back. Mm -hmm. All the way to Abraham. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because they, they, uh, they worship their family. Family is everything new. In the, in the scriptures, it said we would lose our heritage. Our heritage would be taken out of our minds and come out of remembrance. Yeah, we, I'm going to get that too. Keep oh, going. Keep so going. I, I'm going to get that too, actually. So I, yeah, 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 that's just a good one. We need to bring that out. Keep, keep going. Uh, that's Psalms 83. All right. There's none to please I cave that cause. <clears throat> so I can. That thou mayest be bound up, thou hast no healing medicine. Mm -hmm. All thy lovers have forgotten thee, they seek thee not. For I have wounded thee with the wound of an enemy, with the chast so chastisement of a cruel one for the multitude of thine iniquity. Because thy sins were increased. Mm -hmm. Why criest thou? We kept sinning, by the way. Like, for example, on the Sabbath day, today's the Sabbath. You probably know that. I don't know. Seven days the Sabbath day. From Friday night till the Saturday night when the sun goes down here. We're in the midst of the Sabbath day. And then the Sabbath day it told us to, you know, not, if we can, if you can, we're in captivity now, but if you can help it, not to do any work, right. not to, we shouldn't cook on that day, kindle a fire. Um, should night be, to the evening. After sundown. Yeah, after sundown, yeah, but during the day, keep the Sabbath day holy. Be resting. It's a day of rest and study and worship towards your house. I'm sorry, I do that. I do this. <laughs> no, yeah, when you right, like, like that's why we stated right, if right. you can't if get you around can't, it. Right. If you can't get buddy, let's say you're off on Saturday. Then you keep the Sabbath. Right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's right. That's All that lovers have forgotten me. They seek me not. I have wounded thee with the wound of an enemy. Oh, I slide, you already read that. Verse 15. Why criest thou for thy thine affliction? Mm. That's us crying right now. In the streets yeah. right now, when everything's happened, why can't we get justice brother, for, brother, for it? Brother, 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 thou sorrow, thy sorrow is incurable for the multitude of thine iniquity, thou sin, because thy sins were increased. Mm -hmm. I have done these things unto thee. So the Most High saying he, that he's allowing these things to happen, he's doing these things because we're not coming to him. We're not following his commandments. We'd rather worship anything else but him, which is the God of this Bible. The God of the, the, the God that's preached to love everybody and all that, that's a different God. That's not the same God that's in the Bible. Yeah. You know? So, Psalms 83. Well, God is all love, but if he's all love, then he said, 
when you made a jacket and eat He said, Jacket about love, and you saw how about hate. It's not, because before they were born, and before they even came out the womb, you know what I'm saying? He said that, because that's what he, they were birthed. That's, that's what the Most High said. And he hated Esau before he even was born. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? Yeah. That's why they didn't want none of the men to the boy to be born. They wanted their yeah, they wanted the most high chose his people. He chose he chose the nation of Israel to be and we identified by these curses that happened upon us. You know, again, you know, generally generally, you know, the, the people who are listed minority, so-called, you know, African Americans, so-called Hispanics, so-called Native Americans. However, there's other amongst us that were scattered as well. That's why we're not gonna close our ears to someone who may write off on a job resume as a white or an Asian person, but they believe in this word. They gotta be an Israelite. Like you said, we can't trace our bloodlines 2,000 years ago. Right. So, we, yeah. So we're, we're gonna, and we've met, we've met, uh, we've met, a, we've, we've come, we've seen people on, on online, and we've met a brother who actually identified yeah. us as Irish, but he believes in his word. We were with him, and his, his soul was quickened by by the, the scriptures of the, of the Bible. Exactly. But but we know by these curses yeah. that we're suffering here in in America and across the four corners of the earth. They don't. That's why they, they believe what they do. Yeah. That's, that's why they out here partying, and, you know, drawing, yeah. doing all this crazy madness. So, I mean, they think that's just the normal. It's not the normal. That's what you're doing. Yeah. Let me, let's get you this real quick, sister. Uh, Psalms 83. We talk, talk about what we talked about. We said get rid of the remembrance of our name. This is how you know. Psalms 83. Uh, Keep not thou silence, O Yahweh. That's the name of the uh, Heavenly Father. Hold not thy peace and be not still, O Yahweh. For lo, thine enemies make a tumult, and they that hate thee have lifted up the head. These, these enemies, we clearly got enemies out here, these other nations. Um, they have taken crafty counsel against thy people and consulted against thy hidden ones. The children of Israel would be the hidden ones. They're taking crafty counsel against us, means they try, they figure out what it is. They know that when we disobey the Most High, he gets angry with us yeah. and we get put under subjection. We lose that connection with the most high. Uh -huh. Everything, the more we keep doing the you know, doing, doing the wrong things by, you know, not following the wrong sections of commandments, cheating on our, you know, stuff like that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Or vice versa. You know what I'm saying? That happens. Not not doing our duties right. as as spouses. Right. According to the Lord. Yeah. But For, you know they have said Brother had, brother had long talks with me because a lot of things would have happened. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But, they, well, oh, you know, so I can learn. They have said, come and let us cut them off from being a nation that the name of Israel may be in no more remembrance. So they said, they're, they're getting together, talking to each other, and said, let's do what we can do to put our foot on these people's necks so that they don't even remember what their true identity is. We're gonna call them African-Americans. We're gonna call them colored people. We're gonna call them niggas. Gonna call them blacks, right? Or Hispanics, or or, or Spicks, or whatever. You know what I'm saying we're gonna call them all Native Americans. We're gonna call them these names, uh, so they don't remember who they are as a people, so they don't go back to their power. That's why there's a lot of misconception. The Christian Church plays into that too, because they tell us the wrong things so that we stay in sin, according to the Most High. You know, um, it says, for the, here's the names of the nations that are enemies. So they have consulted together with one consent. They are confederate against thee. Confederate, does that, ring, that sound familiar, right? Yeah. Uh-huh, confederate. The confederate, what's, what's, the, what's the one thing that we hate that's, that starts with confederate? Exactly. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah, no, it's just true. That's true, sis. Right, right. Here's the people. The, tab the tabernacles of Edom. Now, in general, in general, Edom would be according to the scriptures. Who's the enemies that are oppressing us most? Who, who you see is killing us? Okay. White, white, white. Yeah. Yeah, hey, white people, so-called white people. In general, in general, because we're, we're, not, we're not saying it's yeah, all of them. it's them and it's ourselves, but... You know, we're, we're, yeah. Because of what we do, 
we allow ourselves to put in subjection and then they can go and do that to us. Right. That's what happens. Right. But this is the reason why we're in the situation we're in. It's alright, everything's being cleaned up. Cause those cops, they going, they being chicken. How you doing, y'all? What What's going on? Feel free to stop by. We were just giving the word out, man. Alright. <laughs> no problem. See, and that's, that's the thing. So, we, that, that's. That's. See? 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 Eat, um, eat them. And the Ishmaelites. The Ishmaelites, yeah, typically some Arab, you know, yeah. general. That, that it, it, it could vary off. So called Middle Eastern. Yeah, in general. In general. Iran, Iran. Yeah, they, you know, they could they type with their religion too. Who? Of Moab. Moab would be like Chinese, Asian. In general. Okay. In general. Okay. In general. Yeah. And Hagarine. So we're just, we're, these are the people that consulted to make us not remember who we are. So we talk about, and we want to get to this, right? We want to talk about what's needed because it says, but times are going to, it's going to get worse. Yeah. You said, you, you said, um, you didn't know that stuff like this was going to happen. Oh, it's going to get worse. It says in the scripture it's going to get worse. Jacob's trouble. Isaiah 9 and 8. Isaiah 9 and 8. We're going to tell you, this is how it's going to get really, really, this ain't nothing compared to what we're going to see. You get Isaiah 9 and 8, I'm going to give to you Deuteronomy, uh, you got it? Yep. Isaiah right, 9 and 8. Uh -huh. Their tongue is as an arrow shot out of it, speaking deception or deceit. So I can see one speaking peaceably, peaceably to his neighbor with his mouth. But in heart, he led his way. Uh -huh. Shall I not visit them for these things, saith Yahweh? Shall not my soul be avenged on such a nation as this? For the mountains will I take up weeping and wailing, and for the habitation of the wilderness, mm -hmm. a lamentation, because they are burnt up, so that none can pass through them. Neither can man hear the voice of the cattle, both the fowl of the heavens and the beasts are fled, they are gone. Yeah, man. Wait, wait, what verse is that? You know? Jeremiah. Oh, so I can. Yeah, Jeremiah. Yeah. Okay, yeah, Isaiah. Oh. <laughs> My bad, man. Yeah, you good. Start, yeah. You good. I'm going to start on this. Deuteronomy 28 and. Uh, I had the words right under here. You good? Right under That's going here. Going to Deuteronomy. Uh, 28 and 53. Here's a curse. This is a curse that's going to, I'm going to bring both of them. This is a curse of why things happen with relationships now and what's going to happen in the time to come because of our disobedience towards the Most High. Isaiah 9 and 8, yeah. Uh, so here we go. Let's start with 53, 52. And he shall besage thee in all thy gates until thy high and fenced walls come down, wherein thou truest throughout all thy land. And he shall besage thee in thy gates throughout all thy land, when Yahweh thy power have given thee. And here's what's going to happen. And thou shalt eat the fruit of thine own body, the flesh of thy sons and of thy daughters, which Yahweh thy power have given thee in the sage and in the straightness, wherein thy enemies shall distress thee. So meaning, in once this time, when Marshall going to see Marshall Law and all this stuff pop up, Told famine of the, of, uh, food, famine of the word, mm -hmm. maybe cannibalism, and all that stuff. Going yeah, you're going. There's going to be amongst our people too. There's going to be amongst our people that are going to have to resort to eating their own children. children. That's, that's 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 what it says. Here's 54. Because we know we hey, you know we kill each other, right? We we always killing each other too. So that the man. Oh, that's Diane. Yeah, Not yet, but that's that's yeah, gonna happen. It's, it's gonna happen. It's gonna get to that time when you got. Happen. Yeah, it's gonna happen. If you don't, huh? Yeah, yeah. Because happening now. Because check it. They, they they set up there like a lot of these farmers. They're burning up crops because they we could, we couldn't sell because of COVID night. They had nobody to, to, to pull the crop, the crop the, the um the lands. You know what I'm saying? They kept a lot of like livestock, like beef, uh, uh other farm animals that you know, chicken and stuff like that. They they killed and buried. Them. Yeah. When the COVID-19 got like so real hot and heavy. Because of the workers that was in the meat plant by Purdue and Tyson. What's going on? How you doing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Doing good. Doing good. Appreciate y'all. You know what I'm saying? Uh, they, they found out they're like one. I can't even have meat anyway because I got hot cholesterol. So it's not like eating meat. 
Oh, his brother. Freaking, you know, he made him more. Freaking eat. hot. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. Always yeah. getting pulled out of them. Stay, stay, true. Yeah. Stay away from that. Yeah, that's that's how we eat wild bats. Go to the gang store right there. Cherry tart. Cholesterol and tea. Knock it out there. Yeah. Hey, that's what you gotta do. Do what's good according to your health, man. Yeah. Yeah. Got you. Um, here's the Wasn't we supposed to be vegetarian? What do we vegetarian first before we eat? Well, so everybody's no, eating out of the garden. Won't everybody eating out the garden? They really yeah. won't eat. Well, they, they were given uh, all the land of animals they were able to kill. So it's, it's lawful to eat meat, but it's, your, it's in your liberty to, uh, you got to understand too, when the people in the garden, if you're talking about back then, yeah. that was a different time than where we're in now. You didn't have our oppressors over here putting pesticides and injecting the food and, and stressing the, the, the animals out before they killed them. Right. That meat was, that was on point. Right. You know? Not, meat not supposed to be strangled. They had to sit there, yank the cows. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Stuff like that. Yeah. 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 Yeah most high because mm -hmm. that's a sin yeah. it's a sin's transgression of the law yeah. 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 that was good that you stopped by sister go ahead no, right you're one out of one out of, i'm gonna say one we talked to uh one brother before yeah we're not yeah, gonna yeah, count yeah. that we're not gonna count that not, one not the brother we were talking to earlier but yeah. uh last week was last week week before that no we're talking about just today i'm talking about just today oh okay. we talked to one brother who was sincerely coming over to have a dialogue yeah i'm not counting that other brother but right 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 yeah. right right right, right, right. So yeah, that's good. Um, oh, that was two actually. It was two. How many people? You make three. You mean get two like as? How many you talked to today? Yeah, I think we try to talk to a lot of people, but you're the third. person. I think you're the third person. Yeah, third yeah. person. Oh, that's what stops to listen. Fighting me. Yeah, it's bugs out here. We gonna get you. I just want to make yeah. sure you know what it what it's gonna do. This, we, and we'll, this is Isaiah nine and eight. I'm gonna come hurry up. Yahweh sent a word into Jacob and it had lightened up Israel. All the people shall know even Ephraim and the inhabitant of Samaria that said in the pride and stoutness of heart. The bricks are falling down, but we will build with hewn stones. The sycamores, or sycamores are cut down tree. Sycamore tree, sycamores are cut down but we will change them into cedars. Therefore, Yahweh shall set up the adversaries of resin. And let's, let's see what that is, resin. Anguish, foes, distress, enemy, foes. What the world, really? Like my dog, my dog don't like other dogs. No, no, I'm serious. What the fuck are you doing? <laughs> Therefore, the shall set up adversaries of risen. Yep. King, the king of Damascus. Uh -huh. During the reign of Joplin, uh, the eyes of Judah. So against him and join his enemies together. Yep. The Syrians before Hi, and the Philistines. Do I have a bunch of water from the protest earlier? I don't even take a whole bit of water home, so I was wondering if they got a lot of water. Oh, sure. sure. You guys take as many as you want. Appreciate yeah, no problem. Go ahead, please take some water. Yeah. You're almost done with that drink anyway. We'll, we'll take it. Yeah. You want water? Yeah. Here. Put it in the bag. Did you want any water? Breathe. <laughs> right yeah, here. please. I'm just going to keep running around until everybody takes some. So. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Yeah, no problem. You guys want some more? Say hi. Yeah, go ahead, please. Thank you. You're welcome. I'll take one more. Please do. Thank you. Yeah, no problem, you guys. Have a nice night. Likewise. Bye.
Let's let's get on to um so we know they're gonna bring those people together, they're gonna join together, and that's how we're gonna overcome them and the days and the girls of Tormor. But we gotta know what it is t it's gonna take you right to get out of the situation so that you may have a chance of salvation because a lot of our people are gonna be destroyed during this time. So you gotta get yourself we're really in these times right now. We're in the time we brought these out to scare you on purpose, unfortunately, because that's what it is. It's the truth. You gotta know the truth, right? You wanna sit here and wait for, you know, not knowing or thinking something else. And then something's going to hit you in the left field. It's going to happen to a lot of our people. So we're bringing out according to the word what needs to be done um, beforehand. And we're in the last time, so we're trying to get it done for our people, for as many who believe and want to do this. Uh, what you got to do is believe in the Lord and Savior, Yahweh Shah. Um, you do believe he rose, even, the church dude got this right. He did, he did rise on the third day. Right? He did rise, so he believed that, right? Um, now, he did come to save his people. And... What you gotta do from that point, you believe in his name, of course. And baptize him. And then be baptized in his name. In the name of Yahweh Shai, though. That's the difference. See, I know, I saw you see your face. That's the difference. Now, now, I, now since you made, I'm glad yeah, you made that. That's, that's, yeah. Let me show you something right here. Yeah, we got the price. That's so who's okay. sick? Uh, go ahead, go ahead. 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 Go ahead, <laughs> so when you say that name, so mm -hmm. that's God. Mm -hmm. That's God, right? No, well, when we Yahweh say Yahweh is God. Is God. Yeah, the most high God. Is so called Jesus. Son. Yeah, that's the Son. Yeah. And the Latin name Jesus. What's that? I don't know that word. Yeah. <laughs> that, it's Geos. Geos means Earth. That's where the first part. There was no letter J until the 1400s, and it didn't get implemented until the American alphabet until the uh, mid 1600s. So there's, there's no letter J. But by them using that name, it's, 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 it's calling him. What it, what it says in Latin, the word Jesus means Earth. -er. Etymo the etymology of the word Jesus comes from the Latin, and so Jesus is means earthly. So you be disrespecting the Messiah, you be dis disrespecting the Messiah all this time. What's going on, bro? You know what I'm saying? Especially when he was in Christianity. Yeah. And, and that J, of course, wasn't there at the time that the Messiah was walking on the earth. Because the J just. Like I said, it yeah. didn't come. It didn't come to existence until the 1400s, and it wasn't implemented into the English alphabet until the mid 1600s. So his name could have been Jesus. Yep. I know this is new. I know it's new, but we we we, we got yeah <laughs> we got we got to get it to you so you know the true name to call upon. So because that name Jesus is very mainstream, right? Everyone knows that name. What's up, ask your name? Now, I, I know, I know how, especially our sisters, how they feel about it. Go ahead, you walk across the street. Right? I, I talked to her last week, and I said, "Listen, you recognize my voice. What's going to give me that look of you, aren't you? Especially if you see me. <laughs> yeah, exactly, yeah, exactly. Yeah, exactly. Um, if that's not your yeah, name. Who you calling? Exactly. Yeah, exactly. 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 <laughs> exactly. Hey, 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 uh, give me uh, Acts uh, four and start off at ten through twelve. What's going on? Did you say Elisha yeah, yeah, exactly. I was, about, I was about to take off. That's yo. the same name he he does. When you call you call upon the wrong name or the Heavenly Father, or this, your, your prayers can't be uh, fully answered at that point. Now, don't get me wrong. He may do something for you out of ignorance, but now, ultimately, you want to get this understanding of who your God is before these times come to right. a point. You've been, the Most High has blessed you to come here and to hear this stuff um, according to the word, man. So, yeah, he was actually... I'm, I'm slight. Yeah. You, you said, you know, you know the Messiah was, was, was a white man. You know he's not like that. That's the same. Jesus made God. What's the word of sin? I'm going to say, get an Uh 4 and 10. I, I'm, I'm, I got a scripture here. I got a, I got a precept for that. What he looks like. What he actually looks like. This is Acts 4 and 10. Uh -huh. 
be it known unto you all. It's a lot. It's a lot. This is Acts 4 and 10. Be it known unto you all, to all the people of Israel, mm -hmm. that the name of Yahweh Shai, Amashiach of Nazareth, whom ye crucified, whom Yahweh raised from the dead, even by him do this man stand here before you hold. Mm -hmm. This is the stone which is set at naught of you builders, uh -huh. which become which is become the head of the corner. So this is uh -huh. the cornerstone. Uh -huh. Keep it going. Neither is there salvation in any other, for there is none other name under heaven given among men where be I mean whereby we must be saved. Only one name. So mm -hmm. even though this this talked about that oh you can call him whatever, it says only one name that we must call upon. That's the name of your true Lord and Savior. There's a bunch of other gods that the most high gives title to his gods. Even amongst us of Israel, Yahweh Shai out of his own mouth said we are gods. We are not the God. We are God. So you gotta understand like it's talking about we gotta distinctify who we're calling upon to be saved. And those names, I, I know you said, I, I went through that too. Yeah, Jesus' name is in the scripture, but you got to it's a transliteration. Because we know, we, we do <laughs> we do agree there was no J back in those times when the original Bible was written. In the Hebrew, what's going on, sis? In the Hebrew, okay. feel free to stop by and hear the word. Uh -oh, good. Thank you. I, I know the word, I'm listening right now. Are you, are you sure? <laughs> come, come and dialogue with us then. Okay. So anyway, the name, the name is what you must call upon, because we know at that time there was no J. Back at that time, so we got. How you doing, that sis? There's no J at that time, so you gotta, you gotta for real. Um, you gotta understand what his name is. His name Yahweh Shai means he will, he delivers, he delivers his people. Sorry. Yahweh means he exists. He is. Yep. He is. He exists. So, those are the those are the names we call upon. This is John the Revelator. He had a, he had a, a vision of Yahweh Shai for the, the, the Messiah, right? And in the midst of the seven candlesticks, one like unto the Son of Man, clothed with a garment down to the foot, with a girt. Or have you ever seen the rest? You ever watch wrestling? You, you know the belt. It's like that. It's, it's a war belt. It says. Uh, garment down to the foot and the girth about the paps with a golden girth and in the midst of the set oh it's white his head and his hairs were white like wool we got woolly hair we do right we have woolly hair you see, you see how my beard is i mean i don't have you see how my beard is right i'll be loaded up in the corner how's it going y'all how's it going y'all thank you <laughs> 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 yeah, that's not that's not something you want to smoke with. Nah. <laughs> his head and his hairs were white like wool. Uh -huh. Woolly hair. As white as snow. And his eyes were as a flame of fire. He used to drink wine. Because they call the Messiah wine bibber. Yeah, they overdid it. They yeah, they, 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 they yeah. yeah, he won. He wasn't a like, wine like, bibber. Yeah, yeah he, he did it in moderation, man. Uh, and his feet like a fine brass. What's the color of brass? What's the color of pink? Brown. The derivative of brown. No, it's a, a penny. If you take a penny, you burn it. What color is it? Black. Keep that in mind. His feet like unto fine brass, like a penny. As if burnt in a furnace, and his voice was like many waters. Meaning he had a heavy voice that carried. He talked. Like he had a real loud voice. So his feet was like gonna find brass and so your feet same colors the rest of your body. That makes him what? That look, it look like the, the guy with the silk long silky hair and the blue eyes and the pelt. Nah, that's not him. The Messiah was looked like Daddy. Yes, Boogie. Yeah, okay. So Messiah was our people. He was from the tribe of Judah. He's from the tribe of Judah. Yeah. Because uh he promised he promised Abraham 
through his loins, the Messiah will come. And and um, Jacob, now so I, yeah, Jacob, whose name turned to Israel, the, uh, the forefather of the Israelites, mm -hmm. he gave a prophecy to his son Judah, and he said Judah will, will be a governor and a scepter coming out of the tribe of Judah. And he said, his eyes will be red with, with wine and with teeth, white with milk. And um, they said that he predicted that he would come out of the line of Judah, and he promised Abraham that the Messiah would come out of See how Shai was born. Oh, that's another thing. See how Shai was born of man. It wasn't a Virgin Mary birth. Immaculate conception. Yeah, it was. It wasn't a very Virgin Mary birth. He was born of the seed of man. Okay, check this out. You gonna get that? Say, say, your grandfather, right? You come from wherever. Say, say your last name is Smith. Right? How can you, when, when, before you get married, your, your grandfather was named Joseph. Smith. Well, I'm sorry, your great grandfather's name, Joseph, right? I mean, your, your, your grandfather's name, Jerry Smith, right? Now, if you was born, this womb, this appeared in the womb, can you be a Smith? You can't take one of that name, right? Because you will come from, come from your grand, great grandfather's name. Right? That's, that, exactly, that's the point. What are you? He promised Abraham that the Messiah, through, through Abraham's loins and and through King uh, David, King, King, King David. David too, he promised King David that King, King David that his blood, his uh, the Messiah would come through his blood. He promised. Hey, let's, let's, he let's said, "Come it. from your loins." Let's get it. Salak on that. I meant King David. Salak. Come on, come on. Okay. Let's get it. Uh, Second Samuel. Second okay, Samuel. Uh, give me, give me seven. And we'll start at eight. Second Samuel seven and eight. Yeah, yeah. There's, I, I know she said, well, yeah. It, it, that's a big thing. Yeah, yeah. How Shai came was born of the seed of man, according to the scriptures. Because Joseph was from his tribe of Judah, not Mary. Come on, it, from David. He was from David's bloodline. Second Second Samuel. Second Samuel. Uh -huh. Seven and eight. This is Second Samuel seven and eight. Now therefore, so shalt thou say unto my <laughs> You don't want no problems with them, man. That's how my dog does too. She's bigger than her, but she does the same thing. And she with dog, she got no business. Just walk right by her, you know. Yeah. Showing off right now, right? <laughs> Right, the second Samuel seven uh, verse seven and eight yeah. in all the places wherein I walk with all the children of Israel mm -hmm. spat I a word to any of the tribes of Israel whom I commanded to feed my my people Israel saying why build me not why build me not the house of Cedar now therefore so thou, so shalt thou say unto my servant David, mm -hmm. Thus saith Yahweh of hosts, I took thee from the sheep coat, from following the sheep, to be ruler over my people over Israel. Uh -huh. For I was with thee, whatsoever thou wentest, and have cut off all thy enemies out of thy sight, and have made thee a great name. Like unto the son of the great man that are in the earth. Uh huh. Doing all the work for him. Most high has set it up and did these things for him. Moreover, I will appoint a place for my people Israel uh -huh. and will plant them that they may dwell in a place of their own and move no more. Neither shall the children of wickedness afflict them any more as before time. See, so that's how we know we're still in. This old covenant. What's going on, brother? Hey, feel free to stop by, man. Feel free to stop by. We giving the word out, man. Yeah. 
the scriptures, man. What we need to get out of here, man, as a people. What we need to do to stop this madness that's going on, man. Man, you something to leave with? Yahweh Shah, man. You need to believe in the uh, believe in the Lord, man. Yeah. All right. Lord willing, He does. We'll see. But yeah. but um, was it so we're being still being afflicted. We all the stuff that's happening while we can get, still get killed unfairly, we're still being afflicted. So there's no way we're in the new covenant because the new covenant that's not going to be happening. We're going to be in peace. Well, we do agree with that. We do agree with that. We do agree with that. But I think they got their point across. Yeah, we do agree with that. But you still gonna have to call upon the Lord, name of our Lord and Savior, to be saved because. Now, do you know anybody personally with that? Coronavirus. They had a coronavirus. You know, anybody personally that caught the coronavirus? No, no, no. Did you say you was a nurse? Come on, go down. I'm in the field, but I haven't been around nobody. I haven't either. I've met some people. Uh, Tracked it. I have, yeah. I've met some people. It, it's I mean, out I here. I got sick in January, and I was sick for three weeks. I know that. Yeah. But I was staying with a friend. I didn't heal. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I hear that. Oh. Oh. But I, I hear something. Right, right. So right. You, even being in your house when this stuff comes, they're gonna they're gonna take people. We've already seen examples of this on the light work right now. They're gonna kick people out of their houses by military force. They can do that. They're gonna be able to kick people out of their houses. The M law. Yeah. So it, it's gonna get real bad. Check, keep it going. This is why we need to get upon call upon our Lord and Savior. We're still being afflicted by our enemies. I'm at 11. Okay, come. And as, and as since the time that I commanded judges to be over my people Israel, yeah. and have caused thee to rest from all thine enemies. Yep. Also, Yahweh telleth thee that he will make thee a house. And when thy days be fulfilled, and thy shalt sleep with thy fathers, yeah. I will set up thy seed uh -huh. after thee, which shall proceed out of thy bowels, I will establish his kingdom. Out of the seed. That word seed, not to get graphic, but that word seed means sperma. Meaning that obviously you had a kid a natural birth. So he's gonna bring that that chosen child, that chosen man of prophecy from out the bloodline, the seed of the generation of David. You can verify that if you go to Matthew one and one. It gives you the it gives you the um Give you genealogies in there too, Matthew 1 and 1. Um, hey, go ahead. Really awesome. This, so I can, the book of the generation of Yahweh uh -huh. the son of David, uh -huh. the son of Abraham. Uh huh. Again, ransom, great grandfather. All through the lineage. Great kid. All through the lineage. So yeah, yeah. If he was back in conception, why would it say, the son of David, the son of Abraham. And that's only a couple. We got, there's plenty more right. scriptures. We did a whole lesson on, there's plenty of scriptures where it tells you he's coming from the seed line. So that's just a little bit. But you got that understanding? That's what's up. Yeah, so you believe on Yahweh Shai as he is born, according to the word. And because that's a good thing that you, you believe that? Mm -hmm. That's a good thing because a lot of people still stuck under that. Right, right. That didn't come into play. Matter of fact, that was a doctrine that came into play, like I think in the, in the later, maybe like the fifth, I don't know if it's locky if I'm wrong, but the 1500s or something like that. It was later on. It was, it was later on. It wasn't something that was like yeah, around right. that time. Right, right. Yeah. You know, but you got to believe in your Howard Shai as the scriptures say. So what you do now is uh, Acts 2, as we just read here, Acts 2 and 38. Repent and be baptized in the name of your Howard Shai for remission of sin, sister. And when you do that, now, that doesn't mean uh, uh, go to a fit. church. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not, you can't, not, not the name of Earth. Page. It can't be the Jesus. Because I'm pretty sure you've been baptized in the name of Jesus, right? So, unfortunately, and I tell my mom, I tell we, we all tell this to everyone, that's that we had to get baptized in the name of Yahweh Shai. You're going to get now baptized understanding who your true Lord and Savior is. You understand him for the first time according to the word of what it's saying. You understand him. Now you get baptized in his name. Right. And that doesn't mean you go to a church, because you go to a church, you're not going to tell you that, right? So, what that means is other brothers. Brothers that have been baptized, or at least at bare minimum, are believers in Yahweh Shai according to the Bible, they can baptize you as well. Like us brothers. Right. We can, you know what I'm saying? I got baptized and I was able I baptized his brother. We're able to baptize other brothers by the Spirit of the Lord. Because he said he's not 
after after King Solomon built the, that temple, he said he was not going to reside into another another um, temple built with hands. We are the temple mm -hmm. that he dwells in. Yeah. Because if you go to church, they say, oh, uh, you know, this church is God. This is the people, yes. not the building. Good, I, I, could, I could build a building right here and say this is, you know. Let's get that out. Uh, uh, Act 17, uh, I think 24. I, right. think, I think 24. Act 17 and 24. It's in 17. I'm talking about, we're we going to get that. Lag, sorry. Slide. You good? You good? Is Act 17? Yeah, Act 17 and 24. Yeah. <laughs> I know, I know it's a lot. It sounds like a little bit of a lot right now. I know it's like, yeah, it's, it's, man, definitely... it's a lot of information, but we know we care about you. And, we, you know, we want, we're, trying to, we're trying to get get the elect to hear the voices of the most high. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and do the right thing. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Because when it's start, time... Start the process of repentance yeah, the right way. Because when this, when this stuff goes down, that's, that's going to be it. It's going to be it. I, I, we can guarantee you, according to the scriptures... That brothers and sisters that like a lot of these people that walk by and say, "Oh yeah, hey man, I'm, I don't need it. I'm good. I know the word," and they don't know the word. They're gonna wish that they stop and listen, and not just to us, but other brothers across the four corners of the earth preaching this gospel the right way. Right. You know. Here's, here's Acts 17 and 24. Uh huh. The how that made the world mm -hmm. and all things therein, seeing that he is the power of heaven and of earth. Yeah. Dwelt not in temples made with hands. Oh, he's in the Christian church. Dwelt not in temples made with hands. Neither is worship with man's men's hands as though he needed anything, seeing that he giveth to all life and breath and all things. So right now, sister, we're having church. This is church. This is this is the temple, the most high speaker. We're having church right now. Not in these churches that you go to on Sunday because they're not teaching the word accordingly. You know, to, to the word, to the Bible. Right. You know, I, I can get up there and, and, and talk for 15 minutes about one scripture. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, and have nothing to do with it. Yep. Nothing. I, I can go through my life experience and, 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 and bounce it off a, a scripture. Yeah. Anybody can do that. Yeah. But to give the raw truth about this, about the Bible. Yeah. They're not going to do that because if they do, then that 501 C3, the tax cut that they get, they're not going to get. It. Mm hmm. And that church might get, might get destroyed. Yeah. So yeah. So yeah, so it's, 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 it's I'm glad, it's, I'm glad you yeah, stopped by. But it. most I sent you here to stop because we want to get baptized in the name of your Howard Shot. Um, I don't know if you got an email or something, us brothers to contact you if you decide this is something you want to do. But if you believe, so if you believe, you gotta be baptized. Because if not, get Mark, get Mark, get March 16 and 15 out. And just, God, let, so you see this because you understand this is this is something that's needed, you know. Um, wanted, yeah, I mean, we wanted that so as many of our people be saved because this is about to be very bad. Just how we read to you, right? A couple of things. That was only a couple of things. Said Mark, what? Uh, Sixteen and fifteen. There's a lot. It said, "Alas, there's going to be a time never like seen before." Right. This is only the cusp of it. So imagine how much worse it's going to be. Yeah. Right. You know, in the Bible. If it's red letter, it means that, that he's right. And he said unto them, Go ye into all the world and preach the gospel to every creature. Yeah. He that believeth and is baptized shall be saved, but he that oh, believeth shit. not shall be damned. Hey. Let's go ahead and just close out for this one. Got one percent left on my camera. Huh. We want to give all praise and glory to Yahweh, Hashem, Yahweh Shai. Peace and blessings to the brothers and sisters scattered across the four corners of the earth, learning and/or teaching the truth of society. Lord willing, we'll be back at y'all again. Shalom. Shalom.